and greetings everyone and the judges. I am now going to start the presentation but before that I will first introduce you to presenters. Starting with me, my name is Azizna Fazira Gumpulan. Next is Johanna Alexia Johnny. Third is Diana Humaira binti Ismail. Fourth is Islan Shazui bin Joy. Next is Viviana binti Songgipun. And the last presenter is Muhammad Hanafi bin Orlando. Dolcella is a business that mainly sells freshly made choco jar with variety choice of fillings and toppings that suits the customer's taste. And before going any further, let us go through some brief exposure on our company background. The name of Dolcella symbolizes simplicity and satisfaction where we're assuming our customers as person who craves satisfaction but want simplicity, which is why we need to give them a product that will satisfy the standard of taste. Therefore, we came up with Dolcella Choco Jar since almost everyone loves the sweetness of chocolate, especially the freshly melted chocolate. What is so special about our choco jar compared to the other choco jar? As I mentioned before, we serve our product as in freshly made from the microwave. Therefore, we came up with the idea of opening a shop that let our customers customize their own choco jar with ingredients that suits best for their cravings. As we know, there's a lot of other businesses that sell similar products like ours. However, our specialty is on the services we provided. Mostly choco jar were sold in either ready-made form or in instant, but not Dolcella, as Dolcella will only serve the customers with warm freshly melted premium chocolate and give our customer the chance to customize their own choco jar fillings and toppings. Hello, my name is Shona Alexia Joni. For the unique value proposition, we will attract our customer by using premium ingredients that are more flavorful. For the premium ingredients, we'll be using brands of chocolate from Hershey and Cadbury. For the regular one, we'll be using barrels. Our mini chocolate chip cookie are the best because it is homemade and has a secret Indian ingredient. It is also our top seller in troll seller product. Our topping are marshmallow, Oreo, biscuit, and caramel drizzle. Dual Sela is a chocolate that's not need to be heated. It'll make it easier for people who are always busy with their daily life work. Dolcella also provides airtight packaging so the customer do not have to worry to keep the food for a long time. Our price range from 5 ringgit to 50 ringgit. It is affordable for our customer and halal certified. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Jana Humaira binti Ismail. Today I would like to present about channel. So for the channel section, we use social media as the main platform to expand our product to the public. As we know, in this era, internet and mobile phone are the most advanced technology. So we took this opportunity by using social media like Facebook to market all our products to the public. Our Facebook name is at dolcella.bki which means Dolcella branch in Kota Kinabalu. Through Facebook, it will make it easy for us to receive response and review for our followers and even through this platform, we can share about price, promotion, customer feedback, sales product, and so on. So, with this Facebook account, it also makes it easier for customers to browse it anywhere and anytime. Not only that, we also have a website and Instagram to further increase our influencer and promote our brand to people out there. Our Instagram name is at dolcella.eki is a platform for us to share pictures of our product like Chukoja which will definitely attract the attention of the public. In social media like Instagram, they can find out the menu, topping, and even feedback from our customer. So, what can be concluded is that social media is the right platform to promote and grow the business especially those who are new to this field because variation multi-service speed advertisement are already available on all social media that will make it easier for seller like us to get customer. Next is customer relationship. Customer relationship is an important part because it is our way of maintaining a good relationship with customer and vice versa. It does not matter whether the customer is a regular or a new customer. 
we as entrepreneur need to have this relationship with customer to ensure our product run well because they are the ones who will buy and promote our product to the public and even those who will increase revenue and profit in our company. Based on our business, which is Doll Seller, we will ensure that good relationship with our customer to stay together even after the sale and purchase season is by making promotion to them. For example, we make a promotion by buying two jars of chococha, get one free even the price is very reasonable. Hopefully, in this way, it can increase the rate of repeat order from customers who have purchased before this with us. For the business card also, are important element for us to get more customer and also customer easier to deal or buy product with us. This is because all the information related to the business is contained have in the business card such as phone number, email, address, and website. Therefore, with the prices of business cards in the hands of customer, it can automatically increase the quantity of customer and product. Assalamualaikum. My name is Islan Shazi and I'm going to present about our customer segment. So basically, customer segments are the custom community of customers that we are aiming to sell our product and services to. For our company, we divide our target into three segments which is geographic, demographic and lifestyle. So firstly, geographically, the locations that we have chosen for our business operation is a high population density, as well as the center of attraction for any potential customer. Next is demogra demographically. In this segment, there are three main aspects that we are targeting. First is the customer space. Next, the age group and as well as the income levels group. For the customer space, we are targeting those who generally enjoy sweets and having snacks anytime they want, either by themselves or with friends or family. Next is the age group. Since our products are that of light snacks, it is suitable for every age group. Thus, we are aiming for every age group that has taste for sweets. As for the income levels group, our products are not that of a luxury item, which means every income levels group can afford it without any problem. Lastly, we are targeting those with lifestyle. Some customers may want to control their diet, while others does not have any problems with eating sweets. So to compensate that, our company offers them to customers their choco jars to their own likings and preferences. Next is our key partners. So for our company, we have chosen three key partners as our collaborators to make sure that we can operate our businesses smoothly as well as to further our business model. So our first key partner is the suppliers. The suppliers can be any company that can supply us with raw materials as well as the main ingredients for our products. Next key partner is stores. The stores can be two types. The first step is stores that sell decorating materials and the second type is the stores that sells that supply machines that are specifically for bakery and last but not least is the investors we will make contract with, uh, with an individual or a non-consumer entity to allocate more capital into our business to improve our business model in the near future Hi, my name is Viviana Sungipun for the revenue stream Dorsala Chocochar and revenue through the advertisement from posted on our social media such as Facebook and Instagram whereby once people see the ads of our product on the new page it will eventually attract them to buy our product other than that we also provide cash and delivery service therefore we can still earn small revenue from this because the customer will be charged for our delivery service if 
their orders through our social media pages. However, we are still operating as usual and still accepting our walk-in customer at our shop as there is no than in service. The key activities of a business represent what the company must do to make the business model work. So, as for the Dolce Life Choco Char, we are conducting promotional activities through our social media platform. For instance, we inform our customer about the product details and discount promotion. We also share our customer feedback to convince to the other potential customers to buy our product in the future. Sometimes we will make a contest for our customers to participate. Doing marketing on social media is a very powerful way nowadays for businesses like us to reach prospect and customer. Also, it can bring remarkable success to our business. For key resources, Dolcena premise is located in Jalan Matsale, Tanyungaru, Kota Kinabalu, Sabah is our headquarters. It consists of three kiosks which are located at different places at Kota Kinabalu, which first is located at Teluk Likas Beach, second at Owasan Plaza, and last is located at Center Point. For labor, we consist of six partners which run our daily business at different places at, at different places which means we don't hire a employee due to the movement control order of COVID-19 pandemic. For capital, we start with RM50,000 ringgit and RM10,000 ringgit contributed by each of the manager to start our business. For the cost structure, it is consists of three, which first is service cost. It is includes the cost of fuel that we use for deliver our cocoa jar to the customer places. Second is operational cost, which includes the rent payments of premise, utility bills, office supplies, and our raw materials. And last but not least is our marketing cost. It is includes the ads that we use on the social media such as Facebook ads and Instagram, which we paid the influencer and or Insta famous to, to promote our product. And we also conduct the promotional event which conducted every two months and adver advertising at our kiosk.